Here's how to unlock an object in Adobe InDesign. So when you're in InDesign, you can easily lock objects just when you have them selected. You can right click and go find lock, or you can press Command or Control L. But to unlock them, since you can't select them, there's two ways to do this. Number one, whatever spread or page you're looking at, if you have something locked, like for instance, I can't select any of this. I can select these, but this middle one is locked here. I would go up to Object, and then from there you can see Unlock All on Spread. So when we click that, it's gonna unlock everything that's on this spread. It's gonna automatically select it as well, but then you can see that this is all editable, so I can move everything around. Now, if I go back a little bit to where this is locked again, if you don't wanna unlock everything on the spread, you can dig around in the layers to find any elements that are unlocked. So you can unlock objects individually by going to your Layers uh, panel, and if you don't see that, it's gonna be in the Window dropdown, click Layers. Inside of here, we see, well, we see whatever you have. So you might just have one single layer, and inside that layer, a bunch of objects or paths, or text elements, etc. Anything that's locked in your current view is gonna have a little lock here. And so when we click that, we can toggle locking on and off for that specific element. So for instance, the backgrounds down here are these blue paths. And if we unlock that, now this one is unlocked, but the text is not because I only unlocked uh, this shape here. And so I would have to kind of toggle different layers down, which if you have a lot on your page can be pretty tedious to do this, uh, but I can basically unlock individual elements uh, using this layers panel. I can expand it down to see everything that's locked, or I can just go up to object, unlock all on spread, and it does the same thing where it unlocks everything in here. Just depends on what you want to do, but that's how you can unlock objects in InDesign.